Hey, what's going on everyone? This is Jerry Views back with another video and today we're talking about iOS 17.6 and just iOS 17 in general. So as you probably know, iOS 17.5.1 is the latest update to iOS 17 and we're currently on the last beta, better said the RC version of iOS 17.6. So in today's video, we're going to talk all about this update what to expect from it and of course what to, to expect in the future from iOS 17. Now as I said iOS 17.6 is the last big update to iOS 17. We're currently also going through the beta stages of iOS 18 and Apple has shifted its focus towards iOS 18. They have a lot of work to do with a lot of features on iOS 18 that still have to actually come out on beta and during the year they will come out of course to the public as well so ios 17 is basically done i don't see apple releasing any other big new features on ios 17 or just any features at all ios 17.6 will be the last big update to ios 17. so let's go ahead and take a look at this update and see what the last big update to ios 17 will bring to your device so this should be a small update of course the size should be maybe like 200 to 300 megabytes the build number for ios 17.6 is 21 g 79 and the release date for iOS 17.6 will most likely be July 29th. This Monday, you can expect iOS 17.6 to come out and of course come to your device. So what's new with iOS 17.6? Well, a few things have changed. We have a few like smaller features that Apple has added to iOS 17 with 17.6. First of all, just like on iOS 18, instead of Siri and dictation, if you go to privacy here, and then you go right here to location services you will now see just siri instead of siri and dictation we also have a few updates when it comes to privacy there is an update to the shortcuts app so when basically when a shortcut requires to have access to some of your privacy on your device you will get this new pop-up which has now been updated with a different text also a pretty cool new feature for the messages app with iOS 17.6 is that you will now get an alert for unknown international senders so when you receive the message basically this new alert that has been added to chat kit for iMessage will basically let you know that this message is from an unknown un international sender so that's a really really cool new feature another addition that apple has brought to ios 17 with 17.6 will be on the news app so the news app on ios 17.6 will have a new feature that will give you the chance to actually schedule live activities for different news so this is a feature that of course is currently on ios 18 beta and you'd also get it now with ios 17.6 there are a few smaller features as well like the standings on the apple tv app they have been updated as well you will have also an updated text here for your legacy contact so when you actually go to enable the legacy contact you will have this new pop-up right there with basically more information of what you're doing also catch up for live sports on the tv app is a new feature that apple has added to the tv app on the new ios 17.6 so these are some of the new features that apple has added to ios 17.6 now i'm currently running ios 18 here on beta 4 and of course all the focus has now shifted to ios 18 so i don't have a device with 17.6 where i could test the battery or the performance but being that it's so late on iOS 17 of course you can expect the battery and performance to be all good probably somewhere around the same as iOS 17.5 so again as far as the release date goes we talked about it it's July 29th most likely if it doesn't happen that day it should be on Tuesday which is July the 30th so should you update or not to iOS 17.6 
Well, if you're on iOS 17, of course, you should update. This is the last big update to iOS 17. You want to update, make sure you have all the new features, all the fixes and everything else. And then, of course, wait a bit more for iOS 18, because if you have iOS 17 on your device, you will also get iOS 18 because all the devices that do support iOS 17 also support the new iOS 18. So that's pretty much it for this video, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please make sure to smash that like button, subscribe for more, and I'll see you on the next one.